the human oral cavity is a site very rich in microorganisms. On average, a human individual can have up to 400 different species. Out of those ones, the majority are beneficial to our health. However, there is a small group known as the opportunistic pathogens that can take the opportunity when the local immune system is decreased for a particular number of reasons to cause a infection in the oral mucosa or to initiate a dental caries. Our research involves investigating how the common stimulants such as alcohol and tobacco affect or alter the growth of normal microorganisms in the oral cavity. These stimulants can lead to changes in the colonization of the oral cavity by these microorganisms, leading to certain diseases or increase in certain diseases such as caries and other infectious uh, oral diseases. We believe that the consumption of these materials must be controlled in order to prevent serious diseases from occurring in at-risk populations. Our research study has been performed on saliva samples from over 100 patients recruited in the Theo University Dental Clinic. This uh, research study has been published recently in Letters in Applied Microbiology. Future work by our group is focusing on the investigation of other stimulants which also alter the oral flora and the oral cavity. We're also investigating how changes in the oral cavity can lead to other diseases which are very important in the oral cavity such as periodontitis and gingivitis. Our work will inform decisions made by dentists as to the treatment and care of high-risk population groups.